Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So last week, as posted, Microsoft released Edge version 119, which is our latest release. And just to let you know about a small change that Microsoft didn't mention in the release notes for version 119. Now, I'll leave that video down below. I did post on that latest release if you'd like more info. But um, in version 118, which was the previous release, as many of you may know, here in the sidebar, we get this auto hard sidebar option here at the bottom of the sidebar, which um, if you click on that, it gives you the option to auto hard the sidebar. And then if you head up to Copilot, hover over the Copilot logo, obviously then it shows the uh, sidebar. And if you move away, it auto hards the sidebar. And if you want to place that back, you just click on that to always show sidebar. Now, this is where the small change has um, taken place that Microsoft kind of um, rolled out under the hood. And for some, um, this might be a small but yet a significant change. So if we head to our settings and we move over and head over to sidebar. Previously, in version 118, on this page, customize sidebar, we also had always show sidebar. Now, if we head over to Copilot, that option now, always show sidebar, has been moved into the Copilot options, where previously we had show Copilot, automatically open Copilot in sidebar, allow Microsoft to access page content and show shopping notifications. Now, this fifth option has been made available. Now, over and above that, you'll notice that the description underneath always show sidebar, because obviously you can always show sidebar, toggle that off, and then always show sidebar again. It says this setting is not available when Copilot in Edge is off. So now if you don't want to show Copilot, which was an option Microsoft rolled out in previous releases, there's a bit of give and take now. Because if I toggle off not wanting to see the button to declutter and um, obviously um, just um, minimize that toolbar a little bit, I have to now restart the browser. And once that has been applied, you will see though, Although the Copilot logo has been removed, there is no option now to be able to hide the sidebar. So if you now disable and turn off Show Copilot, Microsoft now has made the sidebar always available and always Show Sidebar available, and there's no option like there previously was in version 118 uh, to turn that off. So I think some I might like this, some may not. I think this might cause a bit of debate and controversy. And then only way you can get that auto hard sidebar back again is to toggle on Show Copilot, restart the browser, and now you'll see that once that setting has been applied, the Copilot logo is back. But yeah, you'll see also it's put back auto hard sidebar. And there, once again, we can or to hide the sidebar as the name implies. So a bit of a sneaky move there. Um, I don't really see Microsoft's reasoning with this, but nonetheless, just wanted to point that out to you because that is a change uh, that was um, under the hood, made under the hood by Microsoft with version 119. And as mentioned, it's a small change, but a yet I think for a lot of users that might cause a bit of debate and controversy. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.